God has a special whisper for you today. Imagine this someone from your days gone by is tiptoeing back into your life, hoping to make things right and be friends again. Picture it, maybe it's someone who used to make you laugh or someone you shared secrets with, now thinking of you and wanting to patch things up. This idea might make you feel like you're on a roller coaster of emotions, a little bit of thrill, a dash of wonder, maybe a sprinkle of worry, or even a shadow of unease. It's like finding an old letter at the bottom of a drawer could be from a sweetheart, whose name brings back a flood of memories, or a buddy you drifted away from. No matter who it is, the thought of them knocking on your life's door again is enough to make your heart skip a beat, mixing excitement with a bit of caution. God's nudge about this comeback means it's time to put on your thinking cap. Before you decide to open that door wide or keep it just a crack open, take a moment. Reaching back means you'll have to chat with open hearts, spill the beans honestly, and be ready to untangle any knots from the past together. God's got a message for you today, like a secret note passed under the door. Picture this someone from your past is on their way back, like a boomerang thrown long ago. God suggests something simple yet big talk about what you're okay with and listen to their side too. It's like setting up a play date but with clear rules on what games are cool and which aren't. Before you jump into this possible reunion, pause for a sec. Think about what's stirring in your heart and why. It's a bit like checking the weather before you head out and know what you're walking into. Your gut feeling is your best buddy here. If it feels right to catch up or chat, just be you no masks, no games, just the real deal. Got some old tangles or misunderstandings? Tackle them head on, but with kindness. It's all about being honest with yourself and them. Drawing a line in the sand on what works for you and what doesn't. Don't twist yourself into a pretzel just to make them happy. It's your play field too, so make sure the rules work for both of you. Clear talking and respect are the game's name. Re-meeting someone from back in the day can sprinkle a little excitement and bring back good old times. But keep your sneakers tied tight things might not be just as they were. People change, like seasons, and relationships do too. Stay open to what's coming, ready for a bit of surprise or maybe even a hiccup or two. God's dropping a friendly hint your way. Take a moment to think about the emotional waves this catch-up might kick up. Picture it like unlocking an old chest you found in the attic. Super thrilling, right? But as you lift the lid, remember, it might not just be full of sparkles and shiny things. This experience could be like hopping on a roller coaster that zooms you up to the sky and then swooshes you down low. That's why it's mega important to keep a gentle watch on your heart, preparing it for all sorts of feelings that might come tumbling out, whether they make you smile or feel a bit blue. Chatting about the good old days can be super fun, like leafing through a well-loved photo album. But here's a little nudge don't get lost lingering on those pages. There's a whole world happening right now, filled with new stories and dreams. Ask about what's cooking in their life today, what's tickling their fancy, or what big dreams they're chasing down the road. And hey, don't forget to share a slice of your life too. It's sort of like drawing up a brand new treasure map, marking spots for new adventures you both can dive into, instead of just trekking down memory lane. Rekindling this connection can light up that spark of joy, Kind of like when you stumble across a song that used to be your jam but somehow slipped your mind. It's got a familiar tune, but don't race through it. Take it slow, letting each note and lyric unfold at its own pace. This gives both of you the space to sway to the rhythm, discovering a groove that fits you both just right in this moment. Imagine this journey of getting back in touch as building a bridge between the past and now. Each conversation is a plank in that bridge, 
laying the foundation for a path that lets you meet in the middle, enriched by the past but excited for the future. As you both share and listen, you're not just revisiting old times, you're weaving those memories into the fabric of what's to come. It's a chance to blend the nostalgia of what was with the sparkle of what could be, creating a tapestry of friendship that's rich in colors, both old and new. So as you step into this dance of reconnection, remember to give each other room to twirl, to stumble, and to step on each other's toes, because that's part of the dance too. With each step, you're not just moving to the rhythm of the past, you're composing a new melody for the future, one that hums with the joys of reacquaintance and the promise of new beginnings. This isn't just about picking up where you left off, it's about celebrating where you are now and dreaming together about where you're headed next. God's hinting at something special, take your time with this. Imagine you're piecing together a puzzle of a friend you haven't seen in ages. Each piece is a moment you spend getting to know them again, building a fresh picture of trust and friendship. There's no need to rush, you don't have to force the pieces into place. Give yourselves the space to see how the puzzle fits together, exploring new possibilities without the pressure of making it look like the picture on the box right away. God's giving you a thumbs up. Signaling this reunion could be something really good and healthy for both of you, so step into it with a happy heart. Reconnecting with someone who once sprinkled sunshine in your days can be a real joy boost. If you both get where each other is coming from, and what you're hoping this new chapter will be like, you're setting the stage for something incredibly special. It's more than just a stroll down memory lane. It's about adding new, exciting stories to the book of your life. This blend of sweet memories and fresh starts is like opening a window in an old room, letting in a breeze that makes everything feel new and full of promise, jumping back into a friendship with someone from your past. It's going to be like lifting off in a hot air balloon, seeing all the beauty from up high. This adventure isn't just about reliving the good old days, it's a chance to fill up on joy and cherish all the awesome times and laughs you've shared. Getting back in touch could sprinkle a bit of magic on lots of parts of your life, from how you feel inside to maybe even giving your work life a little sparkle. It's like being reminded of all the cool stuff and great people that have been part of your journey, making everything a bit brighter. So, if your heart's feeling brave and open, step up and embrace it all. If you're pumped to let in all the good stuff this reunion could bring, just say to yourself, I am ready to attract wonderful graces. Imagine you're opening your window to let in the breeze, ready for it to sweep in and make everything feel fresh and new.